So, you want to know how many times to eat for this fitness lifestyle, and whether you should be eating one meal, two meal, or six meals per day. So let's get the most important thing straight. If you're in a calorie deficit, you don't need to worry about much. So if you eat one meal or six meals, is that going to affect fat loss? No. If you eat at night time, is that going to affect fat loss? No. If you eat before training or after training, is that going to affect fat loss? No. If you eat after 6 p.m., is that going to affect fat loss? No. If you eat one, two or six meals or nine meals, I've heard somebody say the other week, is that going to affect cortisol? No. It's not even a thing and something you don't have, even have to worry about in fitness. If you want to make gains, do you need to worry about how many times you eat per day? Yes, probably. It's probably a good idea to eat about three meals per day with a good portion of protein in each meal. Good question. Can you affect insulin or insulin resistance by how many times you eat per day? Yes, probably a little bit, but for most healthy people, it's completely irrelevant, so just forget that. I don't even know why it's a thing. In a nutshell, and what all of the evidence is pointing towards at, at this time is your body is clever as shit and you don't really need to worry about much. You just need to worry about how many calories you're eating per day. If fat loss is your goal, you need to be in a calorie deficit and your body will balance everything else out for you. What else? If you care about muscle gain or retention, you probably want to consume enough protein per day. Starting to think a little bit deeper about it. If you eat less often, you've probably got a higher chance of adhering to your diet or your calorie deficit because your meals are going to be bigger shit. You're going to be able to eat more food per meal and you're going to be thinking less about your next Tupperware meal or the next time you're going to get your food. So that meal that's big as shit is going to make you feel more full, feel more satisfied and help you enjoy this fitness lifestyle a lot better. So track your calories, don't really care about when you eat, eat when it's best for you and what fits your lifestyle and which enables you to stick to it in the long term because tracking calories is hard enough on its own without all of the other nonsense that you keep getting sent to you and reading and 